How to Overcome Stress Stress can be emotional or physical tension arises from any frustration, anxiety, or nervousness. It is not good for your health. It can raise blood pressure, triggers heart attack, and stroke. But don't worry. In this video, we are going to tell you how to overcome stress. The basic step is to avoid anything that can trigger stress. Avoid or reduce consumption of alcohol, the nicotine from your life. Caffeine and nicotine act as CNS stimulants, which can raise the level of stress instead of eliminating it. The same as alcohol in small quantities can elevate stress level. Alternate it with juices, herbal tea, so your body can easily cope up with stress. Also, it is important what kind of diet you are taking. Avoid refined sugars. Almost every manufactured food contains it. Switch to natural foods and nutritious diet. Involve yourself in physical activities because stressful conditions increase stress hormones like adrenaline and cortisol in a body. Physical activity or exercise can be used as a surrogate to metabolize these hormones from a body and to make your mind calmer and relaxed by decreasing stress levels. So, when you feel stressed, go for a walk or breathe in the fresh air. You will feel good and calm. Regular exercise also stabilizes your sleep pattern. People can be stressed due to lack of sleep. It is one of the important factors. Being in stress can develop a condition where your mind struggles to get a peaceful sleep. There are thousands of thoughts popping in mind. What you should do is to relax your mind before going to bed. Try taking a warm bath. Stop using mobile phones an hour before bed. Don't take caffeine or alcohol in an evening. Read a calming, undemanding book for a few minutes. Don't go to bed so late. There should be enough sleep, like eight to nine hours, and remember to sleep at the same time daily to make your sleep routine constant. Communication is a key to almost everything. We have listened to it hundreds of times, and it's true too. Talking to someone about how you feel, what thoughts you are having, or how stressful your day has been, it can help you getting distracted or minimizes the load of built your tension. Also, you can keep a stress diary if you don't have anyone to talk to. It will help you memorizing which factors and situations brought stress and you should avoid in the future. You can manage your stress by four A's. Try using these in your life. A's, adapt, alter, avoid, and accept. Avoid any situation you think can bring stress to you. Learn to say no. It is important to avoid any unnecessary burden to yourself, taking on more than you can handle as a surefire recipe of stress. Avoid people and environments that stress you out. If you can't avoid the stressful situation, try to avoid it like being willing to compromise. It's hard, but if someone is compromising for you, you should do the same to avoid any conflict or stress. If you can't change the stressor, adapt to those situations. It can help you growing and dealing with situations without stressing out. Try to view from a positive perspective. Practice gratitude and adjust your standards toward everything. And most important, accept the things you cannot change. Don't try to control the uncontrollable. Learn to forgive. Don't keep anything in your heart for a longer period. Express your anger, your feelings, and let it out. If you can't do any of these, try consulting a counselor who can help you for sure. Don't stress out, because stress is manageable.